Coming to you live from PRS View Studios, this is your Plastic Surgery Minute. So I'm, I'm so happy to introduce and to meet uh, finally um, Mark Clemens from MD Anderson, who's uh, uh, very much the world uh, expert on breast implant associated ALCL. Could you just very briefly tell us what it, what it is? Uh, sure. Well, thank you, Olivier, for having me today. And uh, breast implant associated ALCL is a very rare disease that's been associated with breast implants and specifically textured breast implants. First came about 20 years ago, but really as we've come to recognize it and look for it, it's become much more aware just in the past year. And what are the symptoms typically if someone is affected? So approximately 80% of patients will present with a large fluid collection around the breast implant. That's pretty symptomatic. Somewhere around 400, 500, 600 cc's. About 40% of patients will have a mass associated with it and they'll feel that. And we're encouraging any women that uh, get these symptoms or unexplained asymmetry to go back to their doctor as part of just good breast health. Fantastic, and um, what's the prognosis for someone affected by the disease? So the prognosis when caught early and when treated appropriately is incredibly good. In fact, it's highly curative in the majority of patients, but you do have to see your doctor. You do have to have it surgically removed and the surgery is absolutely key. We see about 4% recurrence rates at five years, which is fantastic for any malignancy, uh, but it does need to be treated appropriately. Thank you so much for your time. That's great.